there are standards out there in the industry for most everything. And I say almost because we have one black sheep in the industry and this software. So all the time I was challenging everybody from investor to CEO to peers so that they are a guru in software craftsmanship about why software doesn't have any standard, why software is not predictable like all the other engineering disciplines. Am I wrong or are we missing something in our industry? Well, it's, it's, really, it's really interesting and I agree with you, it's somehow shocking. Uh, I think it's mainly the dominant culture in software is steel, right? The, the best value, the most revered value in software is built fast. And there's a tolerance for mistakes. Okay, it's normal to have bugs. I mean, it's, it's like, it's even written in contracts, right? The standard software contract, like you, you sign when, when you take a, you buy online a Salesforce or Oracle or anything, it's this software is delivered as is with all the possibilities of bugs, etc. So the, the, the possibility of a bug has been written in the market standard contracts of every software. And it's okay when you use software for casual things, but when you use software to manage a, a nuclear power plant or a plane, it's a different story. So that being said, there are regulations that apply, right? If you use software as a medical device, you are subject to the FDA. If you are, uh, if you use embedded software in the automotive, you are subject to the regulations that apply to automotive. So you could argue that those standards come from the different industries in which you apply software. But as a culture, software engineers, you hire someone, a software engineer from the university, they have not been trained for writing business critical software. When you bring them in the team, uh, you have to re-educate them. And including us, when our software is used in, in many business critical situations, and I have constantly to remind the team that guys, if our software breaks, there are some uh, shipments that won't go on, on time. There are some some uh, assembly lines in factories that might get stuck. It's hard consequences software fails. So 